Hi Libra. It's your girl from Amethyst Rose to Row coming through to give you guys an energy check in. This will be for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node, okay? Libra, when you see this is when you're meant to see it. If you need to refer back to it later, please do. This will be for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node. All right, we're going to see what messages are deemed most important for you at this time. All right, um, we're going to get a spill spill casting oracle for you um to see what is deemed most important what's the overall uh message oracle message from your um, angels and spirit guides in regards to the message that will come out okay so this is for libra someone rising in the north node holy spirit holy angels ancestors spirit guides those from highest white light the messages we have for libra what does Libra need to know at this time? Archangel Michael, please block any interference that stops their message from coming through. Please and thank you. Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node. More Oracle. Please and thank you. Rock the Boat by Leah just came on. All right. Let's see. Libra. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, then. Yeah. Beauty. All right. And talent. Wow. Nice. Okay. All right. This definitely gives me somebody is an influencer of some kind or they're in the public eye or you should be. So we'll see what the message is. All right. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node. What is the message? Message for Libra. Please and thank you. I think you might block any interference that stops the message from coming through. All right. What's the message, Libra? Wow. Temperance. Divine timing. The temperance speaks of timing. Listen, somebody could just be blowing up here. What's going on? <laughs> Yeah, let's see. Somebody could have Sagittarius, Holly Aspect. Or somebody could be dealing with the Sagittarius. Ace of Swords. Strength card at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, somebody could see this strength. Somebody somebody sees something about you. Could be a Leo. Yeah, somebody is the somebody is uh the the nine of wands here is what I'm seeing in my head. Yeah, somebody, they just have been nonstop. You got the four of wands here. Yeah, so there could be something here um, in regards to your home life here. Something could have something to do with uh, somebody's husband. Okay, you got the eight of swords here. Somebody, somebody could just be trapped in their head about whatever this is. You got the Wheel of Fortune here, Sagittarius energy again. All right. What's going on? This is mirroring the uh, Leo reading. Uh, you got the Seven of uh, Pentacles, a lot of the same cards here. Tell me more. Seven of Pentacles speaks of investment, time, money, energy. Okay. Five of Wands. Something could be a competitive lane here. All right. Tell me more. This could actually be like a competition. Tell me more. Somebody could be waiting on the results of something or clarity on something to hear back. Somebody's waiting on an answer here. Tell me more. What is this for Libra? Queen of Pentacles. Wow counterparts okay 
What is this? Like a power couple? What are y'all doing? Y'all work together? Do y'all do something together? This is what, I mean, this is what this is giving me. Somebody could like do music or do something with actual talent. And somebody could be like a model or something. You got the two of wands here. And the Ten of Pentacles, family, generational wealth here. So whatever this is going from the Seven of Pentacles to the Ten of Pentacles, beautiful energy. Yeah, it, it's looking like a yes to whatever this is. Um, absolutely no bad cards here at all. No. Mm -mm. Yeah, it's, it's looking like that there's a couple. They could work from home here, Libra. Um, I don't know if you guys vlog or something like that. Um TikTok or whatever that is. Um, but something is complete here. Something has reached its peak. Or you're about to reach your peak here. And it's about to like pour out for you. Opportunities. Yeah. Um, there's something in regards to um, a decision here, though. Somebody made a decision to just, you know, kind of go with it. So I don't know if that's one or the other person here, but it looks like it's simply time for whatever this is. Okay, now listen, there could be um, some people here, uh, Libra, somebody could be fighting over um, an inheritance, like a family. Yeah. That, that, that could be something here as well for somebody. Yeah. Somebody could have been, somebody could have worked in the beauty industry or did something, um, you know, as a performer or something like that. Um, and there's, there's an estate here. Yeah. Own it by Jasmine Sullivan and R. Lennox is on. Somebody feels like something has, has taken a while and it has. Or it is. Something is in regards to someone's counterpart though. But it seems like at this time you two are far apart. So I don't know. Um, let me just. Let's just. Let's see. In due time, Libra. That's what I'm hearing. In due time. due time you're waiting on something to pay out big somebody could be into like um, stocks and bonds or something like that and you're just watching and you're waiting somebody is making choices here yeah, this is what it's giving me. Somebody is choosing where to invest or something like that. But you're going to end with the Ten of Pentacles here in due time. Okay? And you'll be able to invest whatever this is into whatever you want to do. Or somebody could be coming into an inheritance where you can invest into whatever this is that you desire to do. It's your destiny. Okay, but it has to be in divine time and whatever this is. Okay, temperance, please, for Libra. Tower. And when temperance came out, temperance came out with the tower. The tower was at the bottom of the deck when temperance came out. So I'm going to have something to do with the Scorpio. But I'm getting a new timing. You will blow. People, they're going to love you. 
but you you somebody has the weight can i get one more please for the temperance in the tower thank you the death card something is definitely dealing with the scorpio here um libra yeah so i don't this this person or this if it's if it's something dealing with the scorpio here um Libra, you can have Scorpio Holly aspect it. Somebody is divine. Somebody may be shocked too by your transformation. That's the thing. That's what's going on here. It's like people don't notice you yet, Libra. Yeah, somebody has somebody has a significant um, a Scorpio placement. Actually, they have a Sag placement and an Earth placement that's significant as well. Okay, but in due time, you're going to blow, and people are going to love you. There's a wait here. You you you're here, but you have to wait on the shift. <laughs> but yeah, you just just you gotta wait your turn. Okay, it's, it's coming because if it's not the perfect time and then what was the point of it, you know? All right. So, Wheel of Fortune. Wheel of Fortune. Somebody, gonna, somebody is going to end up with someone who's rich as well. Wheel of Fortune or whoever you're with is going to come into some money. Libra. Yeah, this person could be a Libra, but whoever this person is, you're they're they're going to invest their money into you. So just wait, just chill, just chill, okay? Name by Tory Lanez, yes, your name will be made great in the land, okay? Will of Fortune, you're gonna blow up, okay? Will of Fortune for Libra. The high priestess. So something can, somebody can have Pisces highly aspected, but uh, somebody could be getting. Listen, go watch the Leo reading. Um, somebody there could be a Pisces. You're gonna meet a Pisces by chance. Possibly in your travels. You're just going to meet them by chance. Just stumble upon whoever this person is. Can I get another one please for the Wheel of Fortune and the High Priestess? Wheel of Fortune and the High Priestess, please. Justice. Wow. Okay, yeah. Um, you're going to you're gonna meet this person by chance. This, this, this Libra. So much air. Somebody is a genius. Somebody is a genius. Somebody is a psychic as well, Libra. So Libra, you may be mar marrying a psychic. An earth angel. Okay, so I just heard something and I'm not trying to freak you out. <laughs> Libra, somebody has to reincarnate first. Somebody has to transform first. And then you're going to meet somebody by chance and it's going to be somebody that you've known before. They're going to feel familiar. Mm -hmm. Um, and whenever this person's, um, this is very deep. Stay with me, Libra. Um, 
whenever this person transforms, um, they're going to come and Libra. I feel like I'm talking to a masculine. So, um, Libra. Um, I feel like I'm talking to a masculine who's uh, waiting on a wife or looking for a wife or just kind of picking. Like I said, somebody is very picky and choosy or, you know, they're, they're a choosy lover or whatever. Um, and many people want you or want this person. I don't even know who I'm talking to at this point, but I feel like I'm speaking to somebody specifically. Many people want this person. Okay, whoever this person is, they are a baller or something. They do something. This person is rich. They do something. This could be like a big top executive of some kind of in the beauty industry or talent. This person could be like a scout or like a, a I mean, literally, I heard a league like somebody could be like a, a literally like a owner of a team okay libra but i'm sorry okay so anyway this person is looking for a wife so libra if you're libra this person is looking for you everything has to align just right Somebody has somebody's somebody has to transition here. Okay, or transform, however you want to put it. Somebody's soul and spirit <laughs> has to transform. And in divine timing, that's gonna happen. Okay. So the two of you can't be together, Libra, or you can't get to where you're trying to go. You can without this person, but this person is actually looking for you. It's like you're looking for what's looking for you. What you're seeking seeks you. But you're you're looking for, oh, I want to be discovered. I want to be discovered. Oh, I'm trying to break into this industry. But this person is the industry they have the key to unlock every door that you aspire to go through you, you that you everything that you want all of your justice is in this person this could be a Sagittarius go watch the Leo reading I'm telling you like it's, it's a lot of spiritual stuff going on right up in here Look at that. New beginnings. Yeah. What you seek is seeking you, Libra. This person is actually looking for you. You're looking for the industry, but this person is the industry. You won't even have to break into the industry being with this person. You're going to have everything you want. The relationship, the house, the money, the generational wealth, the status, somebody's last name, all that. And be able to work doing what you do. Because this person is going to pour into you. Whoever this person is. We've got to learn patience. Okay? You've got to learn patience. All right, uh, can I get one for the Ace of Swords, please? And then we're going to get an affirmation. Can we talk by Tevin Campbell off the album? I'm ready. Okay. Ace of Swords. So just wait. Whatever it is, you won't be able to deny it. This person is going to see you for exactly who you are. And you're going to see this person for exactly who, for who they are. You two are actually... Mirror, mirroring each other from afar you don't even know each other yet you don't even know each other yet because this person this person is in their trans transition and transforming 
whoever is going to be your husband or whoever is going to be your wife, Libra, they're transforming at this very moment right now. Okay? Ace of Swords. I feel like the Leo reading. Look at that. Ace of Wands. Fire. Yes. Go watch the Leo. The, the Ace of Swords is clarified by the Ace of Wands. Wow. Judgment. Yes. I'm telling you, that's it. That's it. That's done. That's final. Okay? Yes. The Hierophant. You will marry this person. This is crazy. Beautiful Libra. Beautiful. I wish I was a Libra. I said that in one other reading. The Emperor and the Empress. Oh, yes. I said that I did a reading for you guys a couple weeks ago. And that's the name of it. Beautiful energy. Libra. Y'all been on one lately. I love it here. <laughs> I wish I was a Libra. All right. Can we get an affirmation, please, for Libra that close up their reading? Beautiful energy. Beautiful reading. Beautiful. Claim it, claim it, claim it. Because I want to claim it. Let me meet a Libra. <laughs> oh, yeah, this is beautiful. This person may be spiritually gifted as well, though, too. You and this person match each other so perfect. It's like bananas like it's crazy it is insane like seriously affirmation please for libra Libra, affirmation for Libra. Please and thank you. When I connect to the spiritual realm, I open the door to receive divine guidance, clear direction, and great wisdom. So receive this. Be patient, Libra, in your weight. Something great happens in the weight. Okay. All right. When I'm tuned in to the energy of abundance, I become abundant. Yes. Just know. Just you got to know it's coming. You got to feel it's coming, Libra. Okay. And then it's coming. You got to be ready for it, though. So continue to work on yourself. Love on yourself. Do your craft. Enjoy where you are in this moment. Don't overthink. You're, you're overthinking something. Don't do that. Yeah. What you want is on the other side of your fear. All right, Libra, that is your reading. Please be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Bye.